Yeah, Ben, and it's happened two years later, more than two years later. And it's been two years since uh, Jeffrey Plasek was demoted within the Hartford Police Department. He now has a new position back in the rank as detective. I think that there's enough uh, there that concerned me where I, I wanted to temporarily remove him. That was the Hartford Chief of Police back in December of 2020, just days after Hartford Police Detective Jeffrey Plasek sent a text message to others in the department inviting them to take part in what is being referred to as a Deadpool by paying 20 bucks to wager on when and where the city's first homicide of 2021 would occur. This controversy spurred protests in the city and this reaction from Mayor Luke Bronin at the time. When I heard about and then read this text message, uh, I was disgusted uh, and I was outraged. Following the incident, Plasek was demoted and suspended without pay for four months. The department said he could return only after a fitness for duty evaluation and participate in a community-based restorative justice program. Now he's been reinstated to the position of detective and has a new role with the police department. Today, Mayor Bronin released the following statement saying, quote, Detective Plasek's mistake two years ago caused real pain to the Hartford community and he was rightly demoted, suspended, and removed from the major crimes division. Discipline which he accepted without appeal or challenge and with remorse. He had the right to compete for a detective position, and he's been assigned to an administrative role in the backgrounds division. Some in the community feel the move is a continued violation of public trust, even if Plasek is no longer investigating crimes, saying the training he received wasn't enough. To say that the culture has changed that much, it really hasn't. I'm really hoping that one day these promises materialize, but kind of like a cheating spouse, they never really change. And now Plasek's current position is focused on completing background checks for new hires and other administrative duties rather than investigations. We reached out to the Hartford Police Department for further comment, but did not hear back. In studio, Jake Garcia, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.